Can you give me a product update right now since the last time we talked to you at Oshkosh? How is the program going uh, and where is it going? Sure. Yeah, so the product is in flight test right now. Uh, we actually have the airplane in Scottsdale. It's undergoing flight tests. We're doing autopilot flight tests right now and we're on track for certification still in the first half of 2015. What's your basic target market at this point? Target market is we're looking at the upper end of Part 23. So we're starting certification with AeroView right now for the King Air 200 and the B200. We are in discussions right now with CR Industries to look at their Sapphire program for the CJ models. And we're looking at potentially other aircraft as well. What does AeroView bring to the mix that you think distinguishes it at this point from other product lines? The advantage of AeroView is the fact that this is a system that descends from Part 25 aircraft. So if you look at Gulf Streams, if you look at Falcons with the EZ2 system, and even coming down a little bit further with the PC-12NGs, those operators are going to find a lot of familiarity with this product because it's essentially the same system architecture, a lot of the same systems with SmartView, our synthetic vision system for Honeywell. And the fact that you know we are part of Honeywell allows us and gives us the ability to leverage a lot of that technology and bring that now into a part of the market with Class 3 and Class 4 Part 23 operators that we think is a really exciting opportunity. What kind of downtime, expense, and so forth are you looking at at this point, uh, installation times and the like? Installations will vary by dealer. We anticipate that it'll be about 1,000 labor hours. So in most cases, that's probably about four to six weeks of downtime, just depending on what the dealer quotes. But in terms of the flyaway price, for this standard configuration with AeroView, we anticipate the flyaway price will be between $250,000 and $275,000. This is such a competitive end of the market. What were the things that you were thinking about when you decided to design this product? What were the targets that you were looking to fill at this point? And more important than anything else, is the market at this point oversaturated? I don't believe it's oversaturated at all. In fact, what we heard from customers was very much a desire for some competition in the market, to have a choice, to have some of the technology that they'd seen from other Honeywell products. And so we're very proud to have this offering now targeting those King Air operators. Well, Kerry, we appreciate your time on the floor of MBAA 2014, and we're really looking forward down the line to flying AeroView. My pleasure. Thank you. Aero TV is brought to you by Meet Sam, the new 2-inch standby attitude module from Mid-Continent Instruments and Avionics. Sam's unique two-screen display features high-definition graphics and extra-wide viewing angles. Get to know Sam today. Visit flysam.com.